The Knowledge Whale is back. Here are 50 amazing facts to blow your mind. The Luna Moth doesn't have a mouth, so it doesn't eat. It only lives for about one week, and its sole purpose is to mate. Alexander Solonik was a Russian hitman known as Super Killer, famous for killing around 30 mob bosses before becoming one himself. And ironically, he was strangled to death just two years later after he started his own criminal organization. That's called karma. The Kids Wish Network was named the worst charity in the United States in 2013. According to a report, only three cents out of every dollar raised actually went to granting the wishes of children, while the rest of the money went directly into the pockets of the charity organization's operators. Well, there's a special place in hell for those people. In order to protect the city's water, the Los Angeles Department of Water and Power purchased 80 million hollow black balls to cover its reservoirs to stop the sunlight from triggering dangerous chemical reactions. And that's why I stick the bottle of water. After losing a battle in World War II because of taking a tea break, the British Army perfected the art of brewing tea inside of a tank by creating the British Army boiling vessel, a built-in kettle for armored vehicles. It is in fact possible to find DNA traces from cigarette butts. An artist named Heather Dewey Hagborg used cigarette butts and old chewing gum that she found thrown away on the streets to create 3D portraits of people whose DNA was found on those objects. Well, there's one more reason not to litter. Creepy. Naturally purple eyes exist. This is due to a disorder called Alexandria's genesis, which causes pale skin and purple eyes. Despite being much smaller in size, the wolverine can successfully attack much larger animals, including caribous and elk. A man in Saudi Arabia installed a community fridge outside of his home and asked his neighbors to donate any extra food that they have so that those in need could get something to eat without having to beg for it. What a nice man. A man once faked a mental illness to get out of prison because he thought living in an asylum would be better. However, once he got to the asylum, he tried to get out, but the doctors actually diagnosed him as a sociopath because faking a mental illness to get out of prison is exactly the type of manipulative behavior you'd expect from a sociopath. The Sarpa Salpa is a fish that can cause hallucination if its head is eaten. It used to be consumed as a recreational drug during the Roman Empire. It is entirely possible to see the Milky Way, but light pollution has made that a rare occurrence. In fact, in the 1990s, there was a massive power outage in California and the residents of Los Angeles actually began to worry about the strange clouds that they saw overhead. As it turns out, they were actually seeing the Milky Way for the first time. A man in New York named Robert Samuels is a professional line sitter who makes up to $1,000 a week just by standing in line for people. So next time you want that new iPhone or some SNL tickets, you know who to call. There's a hotel atop the Foranon Buins Mountain in the Julian Alps that accommodates only nine people. Guests can stay there for free as long as they're willing to make the 2,530 meter hike to get there. Yeah, that, that doesn't really seem worth it to me. Samuel J. Seymour was the last surviving witness of Abraham Lincoln's assassination. He lived long enough that he was able to talk about his experience on a TV show in 1956. Potatoes absorb and reflect radio wave signals the same way that human bodies do. So in the past, engineers have actually used them to test and improve Wi-Fi signals on planes. Useful and delicious. An ornithologist named George Archibald managed to save the whooping crane species from becoming extinct by spending 37 years acting as a mate to a female whooping crane who thought she was human. He finally got her to mate with a real bird and the rest is history. William Shakespeare has added over 2200 words to the English language. Some of those words are newfangled, bedazzled, and yes, swagger. The Dead Sea has an unusually high salt concentration with about eight to nine times more salt than natural seawater. This means that people can easily float in the Dead Sea because of its natural buoyancy. Although I wouldn't recommend trying it because that's just creepy. Have you ever noticed that old books have a distinct smell? Well, that's because organic compounds in the paper break down over time and release chemicals that smell like vanilla, almonds, and grass. The pangolin is a mammal that looks like a reptile 
called because of its scales. Its scales are made of keratin, which is the same material as human fingernails. America's first female self-made millionaire was a black woman named Sarah Breedlove or Madam Walker. She made her fortune by developing a tonic that could grow back hair faster. I obviously haven't tried it. Hans Zimmer, the music composer for over 150 movies, has never had any formal music education. Pablo Escobar, the infamous Colombian drug lord, collected exotic animals for his personal zoo. When his house was raided, his hippos were released into the wild, and now Colombia has the largest hippo population outside of Africa. A teenager in Taiwan died after playing the video game Diablo 3 for 40 hours straight without eating. Friends, it's okay to take a break between gaming. You're allowed to eat. The phrase, happy wife, happy life, is actually pretty accurate. A study conducted in 2014 shows that men who are unhappily married may still be happy with their lives in general if their wives are satisfied with their marriages. Astoundingly, the human brain, the universe, and the internet all have similar network patterns and the same growth dynamics. Now that is cool. Norway offers amazing incentives for people who own electric cars, such as free parking, free charging, and the use of bus lanes. Now, so many people in Norway have bought electric cars that the incentives actually have to be rolled back. Sylvian Goldman, the inventor of shopping carts, had to hire models to push the carts around in his store to make them more appealing to customers when they first launched. The first ever 3D feature film was called The Power of Love and premiered in 1922 in Los Angeles. Unfortunately, the 3D version of the film is presumed lost and the 2D version was later shown under the name Forbidden Lover. Christopher Robin Milne, the son of Winnie the Pooh author A.A. A. Milne, and the person who the character Christopher Robin was based off of actually hated the books his father wrote and thought it was his father's way of exploiting childhood. Knowledge of silk production was thought to be very valuable and the Chinese kept it a secret for over 3,000 years. In fact, it was so secret that anyone who revealed it was sentenced to death by imperial decrees. There is a phenomenon that exists called cellular memory. It occurs when organ transplant recipients experience the same thoughts and cravings as their organ donors. There is a fish that exists called the blue lincod that has blue flesh. When it's cooked, the blue color vanishes completely. That's an alien fish! Instead of its gross national product, Bhutan measures its development and prosperity by its gross national happiness. It's been doing this since 1971 and is the only country to do so. There is an English law called Right to Light that allows long-standing owners of buildings that receive natural daylight for at least 20 years to forbid any construction that would block their windows and deprive them of that light. Greek statues aren't actually white like we thought they were. Ultraviolet light has revealed that they were once originally brightly painted, but after thousands of years, the paints wore away to show the statues as we know them today. Vikings never actually wore horned helmets. The only helmet that was discovered to be of Viking heritage shows a rounded iron cap and no horns whatsoever. In 1950, almost the entire Soviet hockey team died in a plane crash. The team's manager was Vasily Stalin, son of Joseph Stalin. He was afraid of his father's reaction to the crash and recruited a whole team immediately. And surprisingly, his father never knew the difference. At the age of 15, Ann Makoskinski managed to invent a flashlight that is powered Powered solely by the hand's body heat. She later created a headlamp that's also powered by body heat. Damn, I could use that for my cell phone. Crappy batteries. Ninjas didn't actually wear black. According to the ninja museums in Japan, the best color to wear during the nighttime for ninjas was actually dark navy blue. Red pandas used their long bushy tails to balance whenever they're in trees. Their tails were also used to cover themselves for warmth in the winter. During job interviews, Google doesn't ask for a GPA or test scores from their candidates because they don't correlate at all with success at the company. Only 5% of Norway's financial transactions are done in cash. In fact, it's possible that by 2020, Norway could be completely cash free. In the movie The Matrix, Neo's passport expires on September 11th, 2001. Yikes. 
The Ben Franklin effect is a psychological phenomenon where someone who has done a favor for someone else is more likely to do another favor for that person than they would be if they had received a favor from that person. There is an app that exists called Photomath that solves any math equation you point your phone at. I really wish I had this when I was in school. Lobsters have some really weird anatomy. Their brains are in their throats, their nervous systems are in their abdomens, their teeth are in their stomachs, and their kidneys are in their heads. Figure that one out. It's like nature's mistake. The Carrot House in Warsaw is the world's thinnest house, measuring only 92 centimeters at its narrowest point and 152 centimeters at its widest. That's a tiny house. Ravens are one of the smartest animals on Earth. They actually try to hide their food from each other, but are only sometimes successful because they're all so smart. Boom! Weekly exercise for your brain! And before I let you guys go, I wanted to tell you about an awesome new series that I'm hosting with Quest Nutrition called Food for Thought. We've been working on it for a while and the series is out right now. It's all about amazing food facts that you didn't know. The guys and gals at Quest are some of my favorite people and this was a lot of fun to shoot. So if you want to check it out, click the annotation on the screen or the link in the description. That link will bring you to 10 accidentally discovered foods, which is an awesome video. And be sure to subscribe while you're there. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please let me know by giving that like button a click and I will see you all back here next Saturday. Saturday with a brand new video. Knowledge whale out. Oh! Little knowledge whale flippers. Oh! Hey guys, thank you once again for watching. Remember to click that red subscribe button to be notified of my future videos on this channel. On the right, you'll find an annotation to my last video and an annotation to some cool merch if you're interested in getting some. You'll also find an annotation to my second channel where I make vlogs, unboxings, and much more. So be sure to subscribe to that. And of course, for all of you watching on your phone, tablet, or other electronic device, all of the links I just mentioned will be in the description below. I will see you guys next week. Love you so much. Bye. I don't, I don't know what that was. Name that creature. The knowledge blank. <laughs>